I was going to start doing a review on my rims, my Rafino Boss rims, but it would make more sense to actually do it when I'm actually by the car, by the rims, so I guess give me one moment. What's going on guys? We back. I am by Warrior Princess, of course, and we are here in my gym attire. This is after. In the freezing cold rain, which I'm cool with too, because there's not a lot of people out here. So, I mean, they're over at the community center, but who cares? So, I am here today to talk about my Rafino boss. So, overall, actually, it's a little too damn cold. I might finish off the damn review in the car shit. Anyway, overall, I love, love, love the way they look. It just, it, to me, it feels like it completes the car. I was trying to figure out what other rim would look good on this, and to be quite honest, I don't really see anything other than these. They just really, really pull it together. There's bird poops gone. Obviously, I have it on all fours. Got the valve caps. I have to replace one, or at least one, because I think they broke at least three or four prongs on it. I think it's the front one. Yep. There it goes. Thanks to the dealer. But they're trying to get it off to go and figure out how to go and put on my tire pressure sensors and all that, but that's another video. Which I've already done, and I need to clean that. Jesus. So, overall, this is going to be very quick. I love, love, love the way these look. But the only thing that I don't like about them is completely unrelated to the rim. Sorry, let me let me wipe that off for y'all. I don't like the tires. It's Continental Pure Contacts. I usually go with Continental Cross Contacts LX, but because they don't make them in this size with this profile. So mine, as you can probably see, if not, then I'll blurt it out for you. Oh, made in Portugal. Portugal. Portu anyway, um, so they're 25, 225, 60 by 18 inch. So, I, I don't like, I don't like them at all. I'm not even going to sugarcoat it. It's too, it, it's supposed to be a all season tire, but I feel like it's more of a summer tire. Just because they're so slick. And then when it becomes wet, and especially how today's been wet and cold, I've been slipping and sliding all over the place. I don't like that, especially how I drive. Granted, it actually makes me think maybe I should slow down, which I guess it's a good thing in that aspect, but I'm not 100% confident on driving on these pure contacts here. And let me finish the rest of the review in here because it is actually warm in here. Woo! Uh, I'm gonna buy some pizza later because pizza is life. Pizza and Caesar salad, people. Pizza and Caesar salad. You want to know how to get to my heart? Cars, action figures, pizza, Caesar salad. That's it. Hey, there, there's nothing else. There's, it's just that's it. I mean, there's other things too, but <laughs> oh, we cannot talk about that on YouTube. So, back to what I was saying. Let me wipe this off because. This rain is not really helping me right now. So if you follow me on Instagram, you probably recognize this spot here. This is where I usually take the warrior princess to drift in this winter time. Yeah, <laughs> oh, yeah, can't wait for that. Overall, with the Rafino bosses, I absolutely love them. I love the way they look on the car. I love how it's turning heads now. It's one thing when I start my car and obviously especially when I've ran it for a while and the muffler gets warm it it pops back at you you know like it backfires and people don't expect that from a CRV but when especially when I'm saying a gas station situation and people are just minding their own business pumping gas and next thing you know I start the car and all this here here is I mean I'll play the clip here when they hear that it just like the hell like what's wrong with you you know so, but I'm, I'm i'm really loving this build i'm really loving how far along this is coming 
I would have been a lot farther if it wasn't for my drive shaft and paying 2100 and whatever dollars. But, I mean, it's that's in the past. It's for the benefit of Warrior Princess here. I can't say no to her, you know? I mean, it's my baby. So, I love, I just love the attention that I'm getting. Even a couple of kids, I was driving um, two weeks ago, just on the road, you know, going, I don't even remember where I was going. I think I was going to Michael's for some paintbrushes. And so a couple of kids were like eyeing me. I'm talking like seven, eight years old, even nine. And they're just eyeing me. And they're like, yo, I like your car though. I like how she sounds. And I'm like, yo, thanks my friend. Like what? Yo, get into it, bro. Like, and you know, that's about it. I, I just love, I just love that. I love the positive attention that I'm getting. And it's not because I'm crazy. It's just that it's coming together really nice and people are saying it's very classy because <clears throat> when I told them like, hey, I'm gonna be throwing on a muffler and stuff, they're like, they're thinking it's gonna be like some loud, rambunctious, completely off the wall kind of exhaust or some sort of thing that I was gonna put on and no, no, I'm just, after talking to Mark and all that stuff and it would make more sense if I were to put on something that would highlight the warrior that is warrior princess and for her to have a stock muffler does not make sense now looking back i'm actually glad that i've done this i mean never regretted any of my modifications since putting them on even with the rim and tires they weren't balanced properly and they sped up the process of my drive shaft end up you know being all messed up in my u-joint but that's besides the point that's in the past i don't care because again Everything's all good. I'm loving, I'm loving, loving, loving how she looks and how she sounds now. So, again, this is about my rims, though. It's not about my, especially not my tires. I do not like those tires. So, if you guys have any recommendations, everybody's telling me Nittos, but I don't have Menino money. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. But, I mean, I'll look into it nonetheless. I just need something more grippier. Considering that I was actually con thinking about running these during the winter, I don't think I can. Even with these tires, these are a lot newer than the ones that I have on my stock wheels and all that stuff. And my wheels, my last set, were wearing away and they're more grippier in the rain and in this weather than these ones so i'm not entirely happy about that but again if you guys have any recommendations please let me know in the comments um this is getting to be a lot longer than i wanted it to be but i just like to talk and hopefully you guys like to listen so at this point i'm going to end off the video there's nothing much to really say about my rims other than i love it Rafino boss i got it from two fast motors in north york Salim, Uncle, Rusty BRZ, they're the realists. I love those guys. And tch, there's nothing else to really say, to be honest. So, like I said, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please hit the like button. Please comment, share, and subscribe for more. I guess follow me on social media if you want. It's gonna, the links are gonna be in the description below. Um, yeah, man, take care.